we're in the great outdoors and we're ready to make a barbecue. Let's turn on our barbecue grill. Wow, look at that, it turned on. We know that because it turned red. Let's turn this other one on. Awesome. Here's a hot dog. We have one, two, three pieces. Let's put it right here. And here's some yummy chicken. We also have fish. Here's two shrimp. A slice of tomato for kebabs. Here's some green bell pepper. A slice of onion. And a slice of mushroom. We also have a piece of steak. And it's not a barbecue without barbecue sauce. Now that we have all the items that we need for our barbecue, let's set up our grill. We'll need some tools. Here's some tongs. Here's the perfect place to store them. Here's a spatula. A knife. And a basting brush. The grill's all fired up and it's hot, so we have to be careful. We can start placing our food on there. Here's our hot dog. Let's add our shrimp and our fish. Now we can add our piece of steak. Here goes the mushroom. Let's add some bell pepper, a slice of tomato, and some onion. While those are grilling, let's get our rotisserie chicken on the rod. This way it'll cook the same time as our other food. We can twist it so that our rotisserie chicken cooks on all sides. Our food's almost ready, and I'm so hungry. How about you guys? The food smells great, and it's ready. Let's get it out onto our dish. Let's use our tongs so we don't burn our fingers. Here's our delicious hot dog. Now let's use our spatula to get our fish out. We can't forget our rotisserie chicken. We don't want it to burn. Here it goes. It's looking very delicious. Now that our chicken's done, we can put it in the plate and use our skewer to make some kebabs. We can add the piece of steak first. Then let's add the slice of mushroom. And we can add a shrimp now. Piece of onion. Some green bell pepper the next piece of shrimp, and the slice of tomato. Let's get it on the grill and rotate the skewer so that it cooks a little bit more on each side. Yum! Our kebabs are ready now. Let's place all of them on our plate. Perfect! Now we can turn off our grill. Now we can add some barbecue sauce onto everything. Barbecue sauce makes everything taste better. And then we could use our basting brush to spread it evenly. Now it's time to cut our food. Let's start with the rotisserie chicken. Here's a drumstick. The thigh. The chicken breast the other thigh, and there's another drumstick. Let's start cutting our hot dog. Now we have three pieces. And how about our fish? There's one, two, and three slices. Our food looks great, but we forgot to make a salad. Here's our salad bowl, and all the vegetables we'll need. Here's a tomato. It's red. Now we have two pieces. Let's add our tomato into our salad bowl. We can add some onion. Here's two pieces of onion. Next, let's add some broccoli. Broccoli's green. Here's two pieces of broccoli. Now, let's add some cucumber. Cucumber is green. 
How about some corn? Corn is yellow. And it tastes delicious and sweet. We have one, two pieces of corn. Here's some bell pepper. It's green. Let's add it to our salad. Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, here's a mushroom. It's white. Let's slice our mushroom. Here's two slices. Here's a carrot. Carrot is orange. We have more vegetables. But here is a fruit. It's a lemon. And it's yellow. We can use this lemon to give our salad some extra flavor as a salad dressing. Here's two pieces of lemon. Our last vegetable is a cabbage. Let's slice it to make two pieces of cabbage. Wow, we made an awesome, delicious salad. Now we're ready to dig in. Great job making our barbecue and salad with me. See you next time. Bye, everyone.